What's going on and welcome to the FanDuel Hurry Up. My name is Tom Vecchio. I am here to bring you three value plays for week two of the NFL season. Starting off with Jamar Chase. Yes, he can catch the ball. And this week, he's coming in at $5,500. Speaking of catching the ball, last week he had seven targets. He had an average depth of target, which is dot sitting at 16.3, obviously, getting down the field. The connection with Joe Burrow from LSU, which is great to see. This week, he has an awesome matchup going up against the Bears, who last week allowed 49.3 FanDuel points to opposing wide receivers. So Jamar Chase at $5,500 in a good matchup against the Bears, another player I will be turning to this week. Moving on, Noah Fant at 5.7K this week, the tight end for the Denver Broncos. Last week, he led the Broncos with eight targets, which is good to see for a tight end, specifically one that is under $6,000. Now, of course, we know he's not going to be getting down the field too much. He has an average depth of target sitting at 6.88, but that lines up with quarterback for the Broncos, Teddy Bridgewater, who only had an 8.6 A dot. This is, of course, something that Teddy Bridgewater has been known throughout his career, not really pushing the ball down the field too much, and Fant can excel in that medium range, racking up plenty of targets. Going up against the Jaguars, we are not worried about their defense. We see the Broncos coming in with a solid 25.5 implied team total. So if you don't want to spend all the way up at tight end, of course, there are great options on this slate. Spend down a little bit. No offense at 5.7K in a great matchup going up against the Jaguars. And then finally, what could be one of the best value plays on the entire slate. My favorite wide receiver value play on the entire slate is Mike Williams at $5,600 for the Los Angeles Chargers. Of course, this game environment against Dallas should be very, very popular. It has a massive 55.5 over under. We see both teams playing fast. Last week, we saw Dallas allow 44.1 FanDuel points to opposing wide receivers. We have a massive 29 implied team total for the Chargers. 12 targets for, for Mike Williams last week. He went for 882 and one. That is something we could certainly see from him in this fantastic game environment going up against the Cowboys. All right, so that does it for this week's FanDuel Hurry Up. I'll be back next week giving you more value plays and, of course, helping you get those players in your lineups.